Exactly. The dude is a genius. Despite Leonardo DiCaprio and Claire Danes always speaking highly of each other in public, they couldn't stand each other off camera. And they're not alone. Stay tuned to find out which other actors had off-screen tensions with their co-stars. Let's start with Sylvester Stallone and Richard Gere. The two were set to co-star in The Lords of Flatbush, but their dislike for each other quickly escalated to the point where Gear was replaced. The breaking point came during lunch one day. Stallone was eating a hot dog when Gear, with a messy chicken covered in mustard, squeezed into the seat next to him. Stallone warned him that the greasy chicken would spill, and sure enough, it did. Right onto Stallone's pants. This led to Stallone elbowing Gear in the side of the head. Stallone later explained, We never hit it off. To this day, he seriously dislikes me. Gear, it seems, never forgave Stallone, and their feud has lasted for decades. Will Smith and Janet Hubert Now, this one is iconic. Will Smith and Janet Hubert from The Fresh Prince of Bel-Air. Hubert played the original Aunt Viv, and while fans loved her, she and Smith were at odds throughout the show's production. According to Hubert, Smith's young age and quick rise to stardom made her resentful. She once said, I've been in the business for 10 years and this snotty-nosed punk comes along and gets a show. Will, on the other hand, claimed that Hubert wanted the Fresh Prince to be the Aunt Viv of Bel Air show and that she was difficult to work with. This led to her being offered a significantly reduced salary for the fourth season, which she turned down, resulting in her exit from the show. Years later, during the show's 30-year reunion, Hubert confronted Smith, accusing him of ruining her career, stating, You took my career away. Although the two made amends during this emotional reunion, the scars from their past conflicts ran deep. Leonardo DiCaprio and Claire Danes Next up, we have Leonardo DiCaprio and Claire Danes. Ironically, they played one of history's most iconic romantic couples, Romeo and Juliet, but off-screen, their relationship was far from a Shakespearean love story. Before filming, both stars spoke highly of each other, with Leo even saying, Claire Danes is the most fantastic young actress I've ever come across. Young actress I've ever come across. She, she's a ball of emotion, a powerhouse. However, Leo had a reputation for being the prankster on set constantly pulling elaborate jokes on his co-stars. Having fun, we get to make fun of ourselves. <laughs> While some found it funny, Claire did not. She saw Leo as immature, especially since she was known for being more serious and focused on her craft. Their conflicting personalities led to tension, and it was rumored that the two barely spoke when the cameras weren't rolling. Interestingly, when Claire was offered the lead female role in Titanic a year later, she turned it down. Speculation arose that she wasn't interested in working with DiCaprio again. They want you for the lead in Titanic. You turn it down because you said it would be redundant to be in a movie with Leonardo DiCaprio and play his love interest. Yeah. I, 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 however, publicly, both actors have been quite diplomatic, with Leo later calling Claire a genius. Ariana Grande and Jeanette McCurdy. Moving on to Nickelodeon, Ariana Grande and Jeanette McCurdy, the stars of Sam and Cat. Though their characters were inseparable on screen, the reality behind the scenes was far different. After the show ended in 2014, McCurdy made it clear that she harbored some resentment toward Grande. In a since-deleted post, she expressed her frustration over how Grande's rising music career meant she missed work frequently, leaving McCurdy to act solo or with props once even acting opposite a box because Grande was off performing at the Billboard Awards. In her memoir, McCurdy also hinted at jealousy, stating that Ariana grew up in a wealthy, idyllic setting with a healthy mom who could buy her whatever she wanted, while McCurdy's upbringing was much more modest. This difference in backgrounds further strained their relationship, and while the two never had a public blow-up, it was clear they weren't the best of friends. Before we get to the last pair of actors who couldn't stand each other, we want to hear from you. Do you know of other stars who had off-camera drama? Share your thoughts with us in the comments below. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Your support means the world to us. Let's talk about Dwayne The Rock Johnson and Vin Diesel. Both stars of the Fast and Furious franchise, the tension between them became very public. The Rock called out some of his male co-stars on Instagram, labeling them as candy asses, which many took to be aimed at Diesel. 
The Rock later confirmed the feud, saying they had a fundamental difference in philosophies on how we approach movie making and collaboration. While Diesel tried to downplay the drama, claiming that his tough love approach as a producer might have rubbed The Rock the wrong way, Johnson has made it clear that their relationship is strictly professional. As a result, The Rock didn't return for Fast and Furious 9. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.